150 million years ago, during the late Jurassic, what is nowadays Europe was largely covered by shallow tropical seas. These seas were dotted with thousands of small islands that were inhabited by dozens of species of different pterosaurs, flying reptiles. Most famously, a couple of small towns in southern Germany have yielded hundreds of their fossils. But recently a quarry near Wattendorf, much further north, has brought to light an abundance of fossils from this time. Besides turtles, fish and even marine crocodilians, the most famous find from this quarry is a nearly complete specimen of a new kind of pterosaur. This new species is called Balenognathus moiseri, and while not especially large, it shows many other spectacular features. Most prominent are the hundreds of teeth that appear pointy but actually be little caps and hooks that make them blunt. In addition, the jaws are curved upwards and their tips are completely toothless, while the palate bears a large keel that is nearly as deep as the lower jaw. All this points to Balenogonatus being a specialized filter feeder swimming and wading through the shallow waters, looking for small crustaceans and fish. Its evolution might have been aided by frequent plankton blooms coming through the Hessian Strait. This means that Balenognathus might have been endemic to the little islands of the Wattendorf archipelago. Its discovery sheds light on the incredible biodiversity of late Jurassic pterosaurs and makes hope for new spectacular discoveries from the Wattendorf quarries.